Hey guys, this is Fee, Diamond in the Rough. And I have a package. Um, I know exactly what's in it. It does say it on the other side, but this is rather amusing. Because... Opened by Australia Post for, bio, by, for inspection by Biosecurity. And it's been released from Biosecurity Control. So this has been looked at. <laughs> hmm... There is a reason, my guessing is, is there's liquid in this that is in a black bottle that nothing can get through because it should be UV resin. So what I have got is craft tool, silicon mould, embellishment craft tool. So we shall open this up. This was a package from bear with me from miniature sweet so it is a, a store that sells crafty stuff I'm just trying to get the right tool for the job uh, sells crafty stuff um, a lot of it to do with resin um, it also sells beads charms, polymer clay, um, rhinestones, sprinkles, glitters, stationery, fabrics. It sells quite a bit of stuff, but it's all for the smallest stuff. So, gosh, to see how we... Okay, some of it just doesn't make any sense, but they fairly did have a good going at going through this. Right, so what did they actually have to open up? <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, okay. So, Miniature Sweet, they do uh, resin stuff. Oh, that's just, that's why, uh, that's why I looked at that and went, oh, I don't recognise that. That wasn't something I ordered. That is because Miniature Sweet actually do gifts. So, let's see what we have here okay so it obviously was nicely packaged but biosecurity had to get in and check it out and let's see what they checked into no it was just they were just looking by the look of it unless it was this this is the one that I thought would probably be what they checked okay so this is Oh gosh, do have you zoomed in close. So I zoomed you in so you could see the biosecurity stuff, which I thought was amusing. <gasps> How's that? Okay. Or did I have you zoomed in? I don't know. So the most important bit of it, actually no, it's not the most important bit. There's lots of good stuff in here. So these are actually the pipettes. I've got a few of these now. I don't think I'll need to get any more. I now know where to get them in WA or where I live. But one thing that I got was their UV resin. So this is their resin. It's only a small one, but for moulds and open bezels. So it's a thin type. Okay, so this one is one that's really important to me. It's got its nozzle. So that's going to be good to find out how that go how that is. Next one is tape. So what this tape is is when I work on um, stuff that needs a flat surface, I can actually pour directly onto this tape. But that comes into play at a later stage. I'm going back to this store to buy more stuff. Just as a warning. <laughs> okay. Now one thing that I've been looking for is these little trays. So see these trays here? I've been looking for these. I found some on Amazon and they're still taking a while to get to me. These are cheaper, so it's four packs of five. These are what I'm considering to use when I 
try out making beadboards so that's for that did I get two of those I don't recall ordering two of those hang on let's pull up my order bear with me um Star perfume fairy tale fairy for oval. Oh heck, I did. I ordered two. Well, that was a mistake. Oh well. Okay, so these are silicon molds. And okay. Okay. The radio. These are what I've been waiting for for the molds. For creating cover minders with. So just bear with me. Well, I I'm just going to cut them out. Okay, so these are what I'm looking at you making cover minders with. These are called shaker molds. Um, yeah. Okay, and then... Okay, that one. Oh, the cat doesn't need to be cut out. Radio. <laughs> so these ones here, you pour the resin into here, let it settle, you push it down, and this forms a shape of a um, of, of well, it'll form the shape of a curved star. So I'll be able to put stuff inside of that with liquid. But I'll also be able to do magnets inside. So that's that one. The heart ooh, is a shaker mould as well. Same thing. Um, and you will see those be put into practice very soon. Okay. And the cat as well is a shaker mould. But... Yet again, it is a case of just waiting and seeing how they go. I did get some little round, little tiny rhinestones. They weren't the size that I was thought I was getting. But they will do what I want them to do. And this one. Now, for people that like big cover minders... So these will do reasonable size cover minders, but this will do a nice big one. So if you can imagine a cover minder that size on your diamond painting, that's really big. Um, but some people prefer the bigger ones. This one here as well. So this is another shaker mould. getting plastic everywhere so stay if you want to see how these are um, done stay tuned and watch but this one will come out looking like a perfume bottle okay so this is going to be so cool so cool um, this is going to keep uh, yeah I'm just wrapped this is this is perfect for what I'm after Perfect, perfect, perfect. So, um, yeah, these will be bigger cover minders, and this is for the, those those lovely volunteers. You guys will be getting something either big or smallish, depending on um, how I feel. I think, um, yeah, I've got an idea for for who who I'm going to give what. Um, purely by those that make comments. Now, what else have I got? And I just need to get a piece of paper so you can see it. So what I have here is 
little plastic embellishments so I can decorate forget this one so the inside of of an oval one I can decorate with these pictures inside of it so that is the Sakura or the Japanese one so they're going to look really really pretty I got two of the unicorn ones camera's not focusing what does that say goes that way that's number bit that's better just says unicorn written on it but yeah I've got two of those and I just have the holographic um, so some of it's Alice in Wonderland there's Sailor Moon in there there's a key Pegasus it's pretty hard to see but um, actually no there you go you can see it without the holograms the holographic stuff going off on there but yeah so they go inside oh gosh I'm getting excited now right so that is it for what I ordered it is this bag here that I didn't order okay so miniature suite tag your creation or purchase with and win 10 US dollars coupon if my photo is fe featured so I've got a $5 off miniature suite code uh, no minimum purchase and 10% off minimum purchase of 35 US okay oh wow okay oh. I've got one of these on order now this is when you mix resin instead of using the cups you can use these and you have a better pouring spout I've got these on order coming um, okay <gasps> radio so these are what I'm looking at here are different embellishments that I can put I will zoom you down I think that I can put inside the shaker molds so this is absolutely brilliant so these guys do gifts and I, I did see someone on YouTube saying they do gifts now okay these here are, are bezels so what you can do with bezels is you put the this tape down and you pour your resin onto it and it seals it at the back and then you fill it with whatever you want to do i.e. some of these bits or perhaps even a couple of magnets and it's going to set inside um, these guys here are absolutely adorable I am not quite sure what they are but they are cute maybe you guys know what they are hang on it goes that way maybe I need to put some color in it to see it I can know see their little now if it was Australian I'd be calling them sweetie pie and cuddle pie cuddle pot and sweetie sweetie pie and cuddle pot or cuddle pot and sweetie pie yeah um, but I think these are twins I think I've seen something mentioned about the twins um, and a round bezel so these you decorate um, and you put stuff inside of them but it's oh wow I am wrapped so these will go I can put these inside the shaker mold, shaker inside the shaker uh, molds um, not too sure about them maybe they're going to be clear if I've got clear resin she's not clear resin I put it it's not resin 
so the inside you put in um, liquid, whether it's a, a a liquid silicone or a watery water substance, um, or you can leave it with air. Okay, and then I have a, another mould. Now, hang on. If I got, let's see if I can find a magnet. So the reason why I got these was so that I could put magnets in them. <laughs> I might be able to use my little magnets anyway. Who knows? Hang on. That's a little bit magnetic. I need to put more than that. Uh. <laughs> um, but yeah, oh gosh. Do you guys laugh? Yeah, I, I know some of you have already laughed at me the last time I worked, played with magnets. But that's what the plan is. This is where I've been waiting for these moulds. I've got the resin. Um, but yeah, so... Yeah, miniature sweet. Keep an eye out with um, some of this resin stuff because what I have decided is um, there's miniature sweet. There is the um, there is also two other craft companies, um, Sophie and Toffee. Sophie and Toffee um, do kits, um, as in a subscription kit, uh, and Every month they send you out a pack that does everything you need, that uh, that provides everything to do a kit. So that's where um, I'm contemplating that because I am loving working with resin. It might frustrate me at times, but I'm, I'm enjoying working with it. But <coughs> we bring this up. What I will be doing is I will actually be able to do a moon and star. I'll be doing a star. I'll be doing a heart shaped. I'll be doing a cat. I'll do a perfume bottle. And I'll just do a simple oval one as well. So, hang on, there's the best way to see the shapes. So, they are the shapes that I will be doing for some cover minders. So hopefully, ladies, you guys like. Um, these are going to be so cool, so cool, so excited. Um, but yeah, <laughs> biosecurity control. <laughs> um, but so, yeah, guys, this is this is some of the stuff that I've been waiting for for the, to do the resin work. This is what's going to make it so much easier than my fumbling around with those little moulds. This is what I've been wanting and waiting for. So stay tuned. Um, God, they're really, really floppy and flexible. Stay tuned. Dearly, I will get my finger cots out this time and use them when I'm doing this resin work. Um, but yeah, stay tuned for this and I'll hopefully... This will do exactly what I need it to do and um, oh what can I say I'm just so excited about it so excited about it um, so guys thank you for watching um, a bit of a give us a thumbs up I'm on the wrong spot for the camera's in a really weird spot at the moment but it's perfect for that um, give us a thumbs up uh, please leave a comment I already have my guinea pigs for the resin um, cover minders. I have more magnets on their way. Um, like I, I'm not, I might use those ones for the back, but I'm not happy to put them inside. They look, they're horrible on the inside. Um, but yeah, we'll see how we go. Um, but looking forward to it. And yet again, waffling before I say goodbye. So yeah, guys, give us a thumbs up. Uh, leave a comment, subscribe and hit that bell so then you're notified of when I do upload something because um, my channel, 
yes, I'm still diamond painting, but this is just, this is, this is exciting me. Um, diamond painting excites me. Every time I get a new one, they excite me, but they're big, they take a long time. This is, this is just, yeah, this is neck level. I know, I have somebody I would like to send this to. Now, if you guys watch, well, a lot of you guys watch diamond painting YouTubers, but I'm quite sure that when you look at these, you could go, we know someone that likes things like that. So yeah, there's one coming up. That's just gonna be stunning. Okay, guys. Um, I will talk to you later. Thank you for watching and bye for now.